Low Equity Real Estate and welcome to the 2020 Equity Colorado Real Estate Power Professional Award Virtual Award, <laughs> award Ceremony. ceremony. <laughs> so Today we're going to recognize all of the award recipients from last year. To qualify, you had to have done a minimum of 12 transactions or greater, and then we'll also do a little bit of the volume in that as well. Yes. And this year we had the most award recipients we've ever had in any award ceremony. Last year we had 18 award recipients, excuse me, 2019 we had 18 award recipients. 2020 we had 27 award recipients. That's amazing. <laughs> yeah. I, it was a crazy year. We miss you. You guys know we miss mm -hmm. you. Uh, but I'm so proud of how you guys adapted, overcame, yeah. and helped your clients live the American dream and buying and selling a lot of a homes. A lot of homes. So congratulations. So without further ado, let's get on with the 2020 Power Professional Award winners. Yes. So starting again, this is with 12 transactions. Lisa Snyder, oh my gosh, at $14 million in productivity. That's 12 transactions, $14 million, and a first time Power Pro recipient. Amazing. Congratulations, yes. Lisa. Good job, Lisa. Next, and we're going with total number of transactions. It's how this is ranked right now. Correct. Lisa just happened to knock it out of the park. With volume, yes. Kara Hoherd with 12 transactions and $7.1 million in total volume. Nice job, Kara. And she is a repeat annual Power Professional winner this year. Awesome. Way to go. The next is Julie Felson again with 12 transactions and 5.9 million total sales volume. Nice job, Julie. Julie's done this before. <laughs> yes, she has. The next would be Mauro Lombardi with 12 transactions at $5.2 million in total production. Yes, and Mario, this is his first annual Power Pro Award. So congratulations. Excellent. Glad to have you on board. The next would be Vicky Opapari, 12 transactions, 4.8 million in transaction volume. Yeah, and she is no stranger to Power Pros. She's been earning them for several years now. See you all the time. Congratulations, <laughs> Vicky. The next, Anna Nalani, 12 transactions, 4.7 million total transaction volume. Yeah, and good job, Anna. This is your, excuse me, Anna, not Anna. Anna, congratulations. This is her very first annual Power Pro recognition. Awesome, good job. The next is Pam Bellier, 12 transactions, $4.2 million. Yeah, great job, Pam. So proud of you, Pam. Christy Oliva with 13 transactions and 6.8 million in sales volume. Another repeat winner. Good job, Christy. Greg Tiffin, <laughs> 13 transactions at 5.6 million and definitely not your first time here. <laughs> yes, congratulations, Greg. Denise Dixon, 14 transactions, $8.4 million. Another great year for Denise, not her first award either. Congratulations, Denise. Michael Carter, 14 transactions at $7.2 million in total volume. Congratulations, Michael, on your first annual Power Professional Award. You worked so hard for your clients last year. Way to go. Glad to have you on the first time here. Yes. Kevin Tiffin, 14 transactions at 5.3 million total volume. Kevin is a repeat offender. This is not his first award either. Good nope. job, Kevin. A true pro. Kiefer Mansfield with 15 transactions and 6 million in volume. Congratulations, Kiefer. First time annual Power Professional Award for you. Way to go, buddy. Proud of you. Diane Mueller, 16 transactions, 6.9 million total sales volume. Another great year for Diane. Good job, Diane. This is not your first either. Karen Podensny. Karen. Karina. I can read. <laughs> Karina Podensny, 17 transactions, 8.9 million total sales volume. Yes, congratulations, Karina. You had another amazing year. And you became a great mountain biker. <laughs> yes. 
Tanya Brown with 17 transactions, $7.6 million in total sales volume. This has been Tanya's best year ever, and she will let you guys know she worked her tail off, and this is her first ever Power Professional Award. Wow, way to go, Tanya, that is awesome. Priscilla Welch, 17 transactions, 6.7 million total sales volume. Yeah, good job, Priscilla. Again, another first time annual Power Professional Award recipient. Amazing, so proud of you. Rocio Cantelli, 17 transactions at 5.8 volumes transaction. Yeah, and Rocio has been coming up for the ranks the last couple of years. She's slowly, steadily been increasing her volume and her sales. So great job, Rocio. Brooke Van Havermat, 18 transactions, 10.5 million total sales volume. Yeah, and Brooke, you are a recipient that has received this award many times. Congratulations. Way to go. Najud Hoag, 18 transactions, $8.7 million sales volume. Yep, and another first time Power Pro Award recipient. Good job, Najud. Congratulations to you. Sandra Shaler, 18 transactions, $8 million total sales volume. Great job, Sandra. Again, not a first time Power Pro. She's been doing this for years now. Well done. Kristen Wiley, 19 transactions at 7.8 million total sales volume. Kristen, you had another phenomenal year, but this is your very first time achieving the annual Power Pro recognition, so congratulations to you. Well done. Stephanie Fellhauer, 20 transactions and 10.6 million total sales volume. She's one to keep an eye on. Again, like Rocio, she's been coming up steady every single year. I believe this is her third year as a Power Pro. Good job, Stephanie. Congratulations. Kathy Harder, 24 transactions and 10.8 million total sales volume. A little thing about Kathy, she doubled her sales volume from 2019. 12 transactions, 2019, 24 in 2020. Well Congratulations, done. Kathy. Little caveat, we'll throw in Steve Harder <laughs> helping you out there yeah. a bit, but she, well done. Yes, she has a little help in the background. <laughs> Good job, Steve. Lori Sanders, 23 transactions and $11 million total sales volume. Congratulations, Lori. Another seasoned annual Power Pro Award recipient. That's just exciting. Wow, we're now down to the top three. Top three. Drum roll. <laughs> Maybe Paul put it in effect. <laughs> Maybe. With 25 transactions, achieving the outstanding sales performance, 12.9 million in sales volume, Mark Baker. Congratulations, Mark. Well done, buddy. Yeah. Mark has been job. in the top three several times. Yeah. And it, yeah, you just knocked it out of the park again. Yeah, good job. Very proud of you, Mark. In second place, this is exciting. 34 transactions, 14.4 million in sales volume. Caitlin Tran. Man. Congratulations, Caitlin. Ooh. Oh my goodness, you had 18 transactions in 2018. You had 22 transactions in 2019 and 30 Four. Four. <laughs> 34. Last year. It's amazing. Wow. Great job. Congratulations. Phenomenal year. Yes. And at number one, and I think this might not be for the first time. Nope. This is her second year in a second row. Second year in a row with 35 transactions and 19.3 million total sales volume. Eileen Kitko. Congratulations, Eileen. <laughs> that Great is just... Job. Not only do you earn the top sales volume for the DTC office, but the top transaction. Yeah, you, you got them both. Yes. You knocked it out of the park. We know how hard you work. We know how hard all of you work, but so proud of you. Yeah. And if I can say, how many people we have here? 20? Um, we have 26 on this list. Um, we gave out 27 awards, Eileen being the recipient of two of those. The majority of you were brand new agents mm -hmm. with our firm when you first started out. 
yeah. and to see Mark Baker and Caitlin Tran and Lori Sanders and Stephanie Fowler and Karina Poldensny and on and on, Karen Michael Hubbard. Carter. Yeah. You were brand new and now you guys are 8 million, 10 million, 13 yeah. million. It's amazing. You, you've made yourself a wonderful life, a wonderful career. You've put in a lot of hard work. So, so proud of you. So yeah. congratulations to every one of you. Yes. And then we do have two additional awards, um, two individuals that we would also like to recognize. Um, this person has been helping us a lot with our brand new licensees. Um, she's been heading up, uh, in conjunction with me, the mentor program. And she has just really dedicated herself to the success of the brand new individual licensees that we've been hiring on the last couple of years. So. This award goes to Pam Bellier, and it is the Commitment to Service. So thank you so thank much, you, Pam, Pam, for all your help. You'll recognize her voice on the support line, and then she's definitely uh, the head of our mentor program. So we really, really appreciate all her help. So those of you that are mentoring with Pam, make sure you reach out to her and, and thank her for all the hard work she's done for you. So yes. that's awesome. Thanks, Pam. And then one last award. One last award. Commitment to growth. Who would that go to? Hmm. hmm. I don't know. Could it be our very own Paul, Paul Leininger. Leininger? Paul has done an amazing job. You know that he's doing recruiting. He's helping hire people. He's now even helping on the support line. He has just grown from this part-time worker who was in college to now really really playing an important role in our company yeah and we couldn't be more proud of you paul yeah and, and i think everyone hearing this right now would, would agree what an amazing job you do and how much support you give all of us and how much fun you bring to the company with your your sense of humor and your supportiveness and, and just always being upbeat so help with a smile <laughs> yes so thanks so much so Paul. yeah not only is it your commitment to the growth of the company um agent retention but just your personal and professional growth uh this past year so thank you yeah. for all that you do thank you so in wrapping up our first and hopefully last only virtual <laughs> Oh, we ceremony. sure hope we get to do this oh. live. I, I think we are on the right track that we will soon have meetings and classes and sales meetings. Hopefully this summer we can start these again. You know, again, we're just following the, the guidelines that really that Smedra is doing. They're staying on top of it really qu uh, closely. So that's what we're kind of doing. So when you see we can do stuff at Smedra, you know we're going to be back there. So again congratulations yeah, to, everyone. to everyone and if you didn't make the top with the 12 or more closings mm -hmm. that's something for you to strive for this next coming year and we'd love to see this even double again next year yeah with all of you being able to achieve this yeah i know the question's going to come up how do i get my award um, yes so you are actually going to schedule an appointment with paul at the office he's going to have his cell phone number and email address on the screen below so go ahead and give him a call or shoot him an email schedule an appointment to come in he will give you your award and if you would like a picture taken in front of the equity logo on the wall or one of the equity banners he will take up that photo for you so you can use it on your marketing and promotional materials and also post it on facebook so all your friends and family um, can celebrate in your success as well. So. so again, congratulations, and let's have a great 2021. All right, guys. We'll see you soon.